Only two sides remain in contention to win silverware. Who's it going to be on this colossal occasion? There is no margin for error. Well, this is the day we've been waiting for. Only two teams now in the running to lift the EA Cup. Who will be victorious in the final? This is Derek Ray, joined as always in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid facing Barcelona. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. No doubt both managers will have set out their game plans and made sure every player knows... It has to be! Just couldn't get it through. Struggling to get it away. And it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Opportunity it is. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Fernand Mendy starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Vinicius Jr. starts. Can they convert? And the last touch off the defender, so a corner coming up. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Oh, and a wonderful stop. But now we see that the offside flag has gone up. Well, you never quite know who's going... Oh, in with a chance! He's going to have a go here. Oh, the post denied him. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Failure to keep it there from Gundogan. Eduardo Camavinga. Lewandowski, can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. So underway again here, one nil the score. Options in the middle. And Bellingham. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. De Jong, can he put it in? And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Lewandowski. Oh, might be, and a goal to really bolster things for them, two in front. Well, as you can see, he's just placed that beyond the keeper. That's a very good finish. Making progress, but really sticking to the task defensively. Vinicius Jr. Oh, big chance! And it goes to reduce the deficit! Still very much alive and kicking! Back in action then, and Real can now entertain thoughts of perhaps pulling level. The supporters want to see him have a go. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. An example of a goalkeeper in top form here. He's given us away. De Jong. Lewandowski now. Can he put it away? Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited.
just look at the bend he puts on this. It's good technique and perfect placement. That's a top quality finish. Really inventive stuff from Real here. And tidy defensive play. Gundogan. Well read to ease the pressure. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And top-notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. Lewandowski, and it's opening up. Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. Well, approaching half-time and Barcelona find themselves in an agreeable position as the first 45 draws to a close. Stuart, they've been impressive. Well, they've played some really good football up to now. In particular, the way they've got it into their front players has been excellent. I've also liked the movement of the strikers. They just now need to take this forward into the second half. It's a fierce effort. Offside the decision. Jose Lu. And now Rodrigo. And the pass deftly cut out. Clearly took a touch on the way out of play, so a throw in to come. Pedri. Return to Lewandowski. And the defensive intervention there. Bellingham and Bellingham really vital interception and the electronic board showing one additional minute And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. So off and running again, and Barca very much bossing it in the first 45. Will we see more of the same in the second half? Jose Lu is with Vinicius Junior. And Bellingham couldn't quite finish. Well, if they can just get one, it will certainly make it interesting. Barcelona have given us away. Rodrigo. Frankie de Jong. This looks more than decent. No possibilities inside the box. And a good take under duress there. Vinicius Junior, Mendy, and showing fine vision, and Bellingham, and collected tidily, he had plenty to think about, Kunde, it's with Joao Cancelo, Rafinha, Really clever pressing. 
Barcelona free kick it'll be here and fired from the flank into the area attending to his defensive chores well read to put an end to that attack Real find themselves in a position of menace but they took care of the situation defensively Mendy and return to Mendy and Bellingham and a precise challenge just when it was required an alert piece of defending Gundogan here's Rafinha crossing possibilities can he finish here oh could be oh he couldn't outwit the keeper and the problem not completely solved Carvajal well Barca have the ball once more and threading it through trying to find the right angle of attack Ball is loose. And a time for calm on the ball. Well, there it is. Barcelona have created chance after chance, and I just can't see that changing. They've been excellent. Into the final 20 minutes. Oh, he wasn't necessarily favourite to win that challenge. Lewandowski Gundogan oh yes it's gone in and now a chance for them to revel in the moment Goals and plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. Space for Real out wide. And surely. And cleared off the line. De Jong. A quarter of an hour remaining here. And Bellingham. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? Araujo. Pedri. Lewandowski. Lewandowski. And is this the moment for Lewandowski? Well, go. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. And that is going to be a booking for the goalkeeper, in the opinion of the referee. And this might mean job done. And a goal! He was composure personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Here it is again. He makes it look so easy. The keeper dives slightly early and he passes it into the other side. Really confident finish. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Nicely timed tackle. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Alaba. Can they slot it home? Gets his glove on it.
And he stopped them in their tracks. Jose Lu. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? Rodrigo. Oh, big chance. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. And Bellingham. Firing it in. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Now sending it in. Can they put it away? And the keeper has it after that tension-laden sequence. Well, what a great first save that was. How did he stop that? Barcelona seeding possession. Rodrigo. Diaz. He's in with a chance. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, taking into account all the stoppages. Is this the moment? And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Just take it. And the final whistle has sounded. The end of the game here. A win for Barcelona. No fans are going to be happy about that. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. And now they prepare to walk together in anticipation of the trophy presentation. Well, it's now just beginning to sink in. They are the winners of this great cup. Any second now, they'll be able to hold it aloft. All congratulating each other, and rightly so. The sweet taste of success. And they don't want to let go of that trophy, do they? Absolutely not. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been brilliant throughout the tournament. Been a top-class performance from them and their fans. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.